Hey, my good friends, Sam Haymart for Test Driven TV. Today on Under the Hood, we've got the 2017 Audi S3. This has got the high output, two liter turbocharged engine. Full Underhood tour, it's coming right up. Under the hood of the Audi S3, as well as the Volkswagen Golf R we get in North America, is the high output version of the company's 2 liter turbocharged 4 cylinder E888 engine. In both cars, it cranks out 292 horsepower at 5500 RPM, and it has 280 pound feet of torque starting at 1800 RPM and remaining flat through 5500 RPM. While related to the 2 liter E888 turbo found in other Audi and VW products, it differs in a few key areas to achieve its higher output. Chiefly among the upgrades is a unique cylinder head with a higher flow. The aluminum cylinder head features dual overhead cams, both with variable valve timing and two-stage variable valve lift for the exhaust valves. The exhaust manifold is cast into the head, which allows the exhaust flow to be water-cooled, which lowers temperatures by up to 160 degrees. This allows for the turbocharger to bolt directly to the head for a shorter path, but lowers temperatures also to allow for more aggressive engine tuning. A larger turbocharger compressor and more robust pistons also help the engine reach its high output here, and though it is still an iron block, saving 72 pounds is a thin wall casting that allows sections of the block to be less than an eighth of an inch thick. Keeping it all balanced and refined in its character at this tune are two chain-driven balance shafts that offset the vibrations and oscillations of the main rotating assemblies. Following the airflow, the intake charge comes through a wide intake plenum across the radiator support, then into a filter box up front on the driver's side. From there, it heads over to the turbocharger at the rear of the engine, easily seen from above. From there, it travels up front to an air-to-air -air intercooler ahead of the radiator and down below the front bumper, and then to a drive-by-wire throttle body and a composite intake manifold at the front of the engine. There, it's mixed with fuel from direct injection, injectors hidden down below the plastic intake manifold. Injecting fuel directly into the cylinders, the system operates at extremely high pressures of 2,900 PSI to assure optimum atomization. In spite of all the high tech, servicing the engine is actually pretty straightforward in spite of the fact that this is one tightly packed engine bay. This starts with an air filter right up front, though getting into it does require some tools. Next to that is the ECU and the main fuse block. Behind those are the battery neatly wrapped in a thermal jacket. Reaching and checking the brake fluid just to the left of the battery does require a funnel, as it is buried down there just a little bit. On the passenger side, neatly grouped is a coolant reservoir and the windshield washer fluid. The oil fill cap and the oil dip sticker on the top of the engine at the passenger side and the oil filter is also conveniently located on top of the engine for changing. Alright my friends, there we have it for the underhood tour of the 2017 Audi S3. Now I've got a complete test drive on this vehicle and you can see that by clicking on the big square right there. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel right there with the round logo. I'll keep you entertained and I'll keep you informed.